cannot tell you how disappointed I am. Now, you can tag your item, and I'm done. So the fact that, respectfully, Mayor Turner, you were insinuating that I don't care and I'm not compassionate about this community is short of offensive. Well, some tense moments during today's Houston City Council meeting. The back and forth centers around a proposal that would help move people out of parts of the Fifth Ward considered a cancer cluster. KPRC 2's Rowan Belogan is live in the community right now to break down those moments and what community members are saying about it. Rowan. Keith, Council Member Palmer says she isn't against the plan to relocate some of the people who live here. However, she wants another week to fully explain everything to those directly impacted. Since the 40s, 1940. Sandra Evans Lavender Street home has been in her family for generations. She enjoys the shade the trees bring her and the peace she experiences. Except for the unfriendly neighbor across Liberty Road. That was the only unneighborly people. You she wants to keep it in the family, but is weighing her options. KPRC2 is reporting on Edwards and others' frustrations about the cancer-causing chemical found in the soil around the Union Pacific Railroad Yard. This morning, council was set to vote on the Fifth Ward Voluntary Relocation Fund until Councilmember Plummer tagged it, moving the vote to next week. I want them to be safe, but I also want them to understand what they're dealing with to ensure they are, we carry them through the entire process. And we don't just move seven families, we move every single person that wants to move. The delay appeared to surprise Mayor Turner. What are we waiting for? For somebody else to die? From some other child to be diagnosed? What are we waiting for? Edwards says she appreciates the move by Turner, but does need time to process the plan. We didn't think that this was ever going to happen, not that we didn't pray on it, but our prayers are being answered, but we still have things that we have to do first before we can take that. Now, the relocation offer extends to two to three mile or block radius around Union Pacific Rail Yard. He and I spoke with an, a representative about this fund, asking them if they were considered adding to it. That person did not answer my question. Instead, sent a statement reading in part, their goal is to listen, maintain transparency, and work collaboratively with the community. Live in the Fifth Ward, Robon Belogan, KPRC, 2 News.